bearing removal. <laughs> Not working out so good. What's the matter, little buddy? Is that stuck? Right, <laughs> Who got that stuck? Oh, was that me? I did it. Shit. Oh, man. <gasps> Trying to use a drift to knock the bearings out. And we got it stuck need, inside the a, bearing. We need King Arthur in here. Now we can't get it out. Hold on, let's see if I can see through it. Move yourself. Huh? Here we go. Whoa. Stuck. Hey, keep doing that. Fuck. Oh, fuck. How are we going to get this out? All right. Can't bring it to a shop like this. That'd be retarded. He's like, hey, man. <laughs> oh, shit. Homeboy didn't think this would work. What we did was put it like this. And that shit came right out. Man, we gave up yesterday. Yeah. Oh, or the other no. day. We gave up. Ugh. That was all right, man. See that? I told you. As soon as you make a video about it, as soon as we start laughing at the fail. All right, so we need a good. Um... All right, we still gotta get this out. Okay. Almost out. See, it's sticking out from here. We marked it with red, so we'll see how far it comes out. Man. All we're doing is the drift. Oh, the drift. The drift. Yeah. And can you see it all? Uh, no, not really. All right. Wait, let me see. Mm. Whatever. Uh, hit the bearing. There's a little side. Just keep hitting the bearing on its side all the way around till it comes out. We already hit it hard. We don't got to hit it hard anymore. We were slamming on this. Almost out. Gotta come out even, otherwise. There we go. Out. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. It's dirty. Yeah, you need a new bearing. It's dirty. That's Still the barely moving. Let me see. Yeah, dude. Only thirteen thousand miles on the bike, but it's been outside it's, been it's outside. a whole life. I think it's a ninety-four. So, yeah. Bearings are the thing that wear. Think the abuse when mm -hmm. it's outside. Just. Moisture and shit. All right, so we're gonna knock that one out now. Yeah. All right, good job. No heating up necessary for this. Yeah. Right, right. It still wouldn't work. Would have just heated the outside, make make it a spin just a little bit, but we didn't have to do that. It's a hot day, thank God. All right, one bearing out. Let's get the other one, and then we'll we'll do a vid. We'll do a vid. Uh, just put one in, I guess. All right. Taking out the other one. This one's easy because everything's open. Got a big hole to bang the bearing. In. Is it going good? Too much shade. Nope, didn't move at all. Nope, did not move. A lot of shit over here. It's all right. It'll come out. It'll come out. Oh, you're thinking about cleaning that gunk off first? Good idea. Let's do that. Yeah. Let's do that. We sprayed some WD-40 and clean it up a little bit. Right so if the case it starts breaking loose, it doesn't have even that as like a little resistance, whatever. You want to start? Yeah, go ahead. Found this bad boy. He's going to be good for this. Yeah. Oh, keep go round and round and round. Never in the same spot. Two, ta two taps, move. Two taps, move. Two taps, move. Yeah. Yeah, like a star, you know, like when you like do like uh, take screws off and you know, do them in a row, do it like a star. Mm -hmm. right, let's see. Uh, yeah, nothing. All right, we gotta keep at it. All right. Okay. A new way. So what is that? A railroad spike? We got an actual bearing removal tool, which yeah. is a railroad spike. And we went to the Amtrak. It touches both sides of the bearing at once. It's like some perfect Just width. go to Amtrak near you. They're yeah. all over the place yeah, over there. Yeah, just pull them out. It, it's so big it hits both sides. And you just got to twist there it around. Go. Is it out already? Man, it came out quick. Ha ha. <laughs> the right tool for the job. Yep, yep. Oh, this one's even worse, dude. Let me see. It's getting stuck. It's like... 
Nice, you see that? Yeah, dude. Yeah, and you with that. See, that's why it wouldn't balance. Was, yeah. You know? Yeah. All right. Another bearing. The Suzuki GS500 has the two bearings that you would normally expect, plus this guy. That goes on the hub. This is for the sprocket? Yes. Yeah, this is for the sprocket. I wonder why the third one is for. I really still don't understand. I think they all just share. Oh, because it's like screwed in certain tight. I don't know. No, I don't know. I think they all share the Anyway, we got to clean this up a little bit now that you can see it. And it's got to come out. So, all right. Three bearings in the back of the GS500. All right, what were, we, what were we saying? I'm gonna rest it on all of these screws. It's gonna come out that way. It's gonna come out that way. So it should start. So, yeah, but it's all screws are resting on it. I'm gonna use our proper. Trusty. Oh, wait, that's the mini. Yeah. That's the mini. This is the wider one. Yeah, but you so know what? It looks like it might, it might put it in, it might stretch it out. I would okay. do it side to side. You might be would stretching you, so it out. You put it like this in? Yeah, you just go okay. side to side. Yeah. No, hang, hang go, like, yeah, like that. So it's coming out. Is it? Oh, man. Psst. And this one had a lot, it's, it's a lot smoother. I love it. This one was a good one, it seems, okay, but got to change it anyway. Fuck it. It's all brown. Fuck it. It all comes in a kit, so. All right. All right. Installation next.